Welcome back to today's to an episode that I promised you. We have finally unlocked the Glows of Zagreus. We have also been using a type of new boons here for this particular run. We're going to be using a Harpy Feather Duster so we get more chances of getting health and have a better chance of trying to survive as long as we can through this run. I really hope to show you guys a lot more story, a lot more lore, and a lot more perspective what this game has to offer. So hey, thank you for watching. If you like the rest of the video, feel free to subscribe. But how do you know if you want to subscribe without watching the video first? So how about we jump right in into it? Don't want to take too long getting these off and going because hey, We've been doing an entire week of episodes here, so you know how this thing goes. You know how it all starts. We're trying to escape out of, well, we're trying to escape from our hot, our father, you know, Hades. Because if we found out that we are adopted, I suppose. Uh, Ares, you could probably use a boon right now. Why don't you take a little ambrosia? Please accept this offering for giving me such strength as necessary to succeed. You are a flatterer, my death-inflicting kin. And I am feeling generous as well, so here, a small token for you of my affection. Oh, Ares, you didn't have to. Thank you. You're so sweet. Oh, I think I love you too. He gave me another memento, a blood-filled vial of some sort. What do we have here for our different types of I mean, what do we have? We have our special inflicts doom, our cast as a blade ripped hurling head. Oh my god. I mean, I kind of want to just start off with my attack inflicting doom. That seems pretty good. Basically, every enemy that I hit is gonna be giving 75 extra damage on top of them after a few seconds. But you know, hey, this may not be a good time to mention this now. However, I'm going to try to do this episode a little bit different. Hey, we found a fishing spot. Instead of being so rampantly talking so absolutely, you know, fast like a bat out of hell, I'm going to try my absolute best to try to slow things down, talk a little bit slower, not be just such a hurry. Oh, we got a knucklehead. Nice. And honestly, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. I mean, I'm kind of talking a little bit slower here, but we'll see how well it goes in the midst of battle. You know, trying to commentate and play at the same time. So I'm going to try. I'm going to try to talk a little bit less, but I <laughs> I think I'm already I'm already failing at it. And I don't know how to how really to talk less. But hey, right off the bat, these gloves are pretty nice because they seem to have a really fast attack rate. So you can kind of run through these floors a little bit faster. I mean, look at that. That Oh, God, on top of spikes. I didn't mean to go through the wall. Yeah, doing lots of damage to these guys just with the fast attack speed. This, now, this is going to be doing a lot better in trying to keep enemies stunned simply because of the attack rate. Got extra 25 health. And hey, here, there is our boon at work there. Urns have a 3% chance of basically, you know, dropping health. And I think it just upgraded as well. So that's right, as a 5% chance to drop health. That's pretty good. So how am I going to talk less? Um... I, I don't know. I guess, do I just have to like leave moments of open air? I, is it better if I talk less? Is it worse th that I talk less? I, I don't really know. I mean, I guess my more genuine sense of being myself is just kind of talking a whole bunch as much as possible. And at this point, I still don't really know how I managed to do it. You know, I talk for an entire hour at a time. And it's like, honestly, how I, I, you know, you look back and you listen to everything that's being said. And I just cannot wrap my head around how I consistently just find things to just say. You know, I think I even said it in the last episode where I'm like, you know, hey, you honestly try sitting there, just talk to yourself for an entire hour or just sit there and have a fake conversation. Ow. I uh, have a fake conversation with yourself for an entire hour and tell me if you can do it. You know, it's just it is a little bit of a nuance in terms of like getting used to YouTube and trying to get used to just being able to commentate, you know, try to keep things a little bit interesting, keep the flow going. And wow, I'm really failing at this, aren't I? <laughs> there is there is no way I'm going to be able to talk less. It is just. God, it is just not in my blood. I don't know why I would even try to push it. Your doom effects deal more damage, but takes 0.5 seconds longer. Ooh, okay, so if I do 70 damage on my doom right now, right? Yeah, 75, so plus 65% of that. So half of 75 is like, what, 37? So plus 65% is going to be like, what, like plus like 43? So I'm going to be doing like 100 and like a 10, 113 damage with the doom? Honestly, that seems pretty good. Also, it does fulfill a prophecy or a fated choice because I've not taken this one yet. Very nice. Uh, we are at full health, so I don't really necessarily have to worry about any of these urns. I don't really need to get any of this either. So, hey, we're doing pretty good. Right on forward into some darkness here. And I think this is going to be nice because with these glows, simply because the gameplay is a little bit faster, it is also going to make the episode a little bit shorter. Uh, you know, hypothetically, it would make the episode a little bit shorter for you guys. You know, and I'm also trying to mess around with the audio, as always, a little bit with these types of games. I would love to see how a professional YouTuber manages to play a game that allows a lot of keyboard smashing, but also not have it come through anywhere on the microphone. Just a second, sir. I will talk to you. I have something to examine here. Within the depths of Tartarus reside the most wretched of all the shades who linger for eternity within the underworld, whose lord and master is especially unkind to those attempting to cheat death. 
mean, is it that we're really cheating death? We're all a cheating death, aren't we? Yeah, not French and And what do you got to say for me, you good sir? You know, I do have an ambrosia with me. Why don't we go ahead and let's give wait, have I given you an ambrosia before? I have not. You have no hearts build up. Um, wait, can I even do hearts? Learn more about having conversations with syphilis. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and just give you an ambrosia because that seems like a nice thing to do. You probably need it. You've been pushing up a rock this whole time. Well, how kind of you what does it give me the shattered shackle so what does that exactly give me uh can i see that anywhere infernal arms underworld notes olympian kithiatic gods purseless no worth no thug gods yeah i'm not entirely certain we'll just have to find out when we come back to the open world pretty much i've not expected to run into you again not after all this time something i missed out in the house or what not had much company of late is all well, something's just about always amiss back home, sir. Figured it couldn't hurt to check up on things in Tartarus a bit more frequently. Well, I am grateful for it. I am the old boulder there, in turn. I'm used to going lengthy stretches on my own, but having visitors from time to time would do me well. Oh, are you lonely back here? Yeah, that's okay, man. I got you. We don't really need any healing. We could actually go for a little bit of gold. I mean, darkness would be good, but I can probably farm darkness and keys a little bit in my off time, try to build myself up. So let's just go ahead and try to take gold, see if we can get ourselves a better run going here and start with. At 164 gold and a little bit of food there on the ground, going right into a mini boss. But uh, what was I even talking about before? Oh yeah, that's right, the audio quality. I'm always trying to struggle and trying to figure out which way is best to do. Ow. Uh, okay, we got to get the runes in this guy. I did manage to get the runes in, doing a lot of damage to me there. My God, hello. <laughs> My God. Uh, trying to dodge it. I can't really see myself too well. I, you know, I almost wish that the dashing distance was, like, lesser. I like dashing, but, like, they just kept on putting me right into, like, the path of fire and taking damage there, which I was not intending to do. That's kind of the plan, yeah. Your cast damage is floating in a small area and can deflect resist damage from traps. Ooh, you know, I do take a lot of damage from traps, but I think my cast damaging foes in a small area and deflecting is me a little bit better just because it's kind of nice to just throw it, do some AoE damage. But yeah, you know, I am always trying to study and see what other YouTubers, larger YouTubers are doing in terms of audio quality. Because sometimes, like, it is just peak. You know, sometimes, I'm not going to lie, like, you see these streamers and, uh, and, like, other YouTubers, and you know that their brain size is that's the size of a pea. They, they're pea-brained. They ain't got, like, more than a thought behind those eyes, more so than hee-hee content. You know, and it's just... And yet somehow they manage to consistently figure out how to do all these audio like options that just make their voice come through so crystal clear and anything that they're doing you never hear any background noise so i don't know if it's necessarily something that they're doing in the post processing that it's being able to do that to be able to try to get rid of all of the background noise in terms of like keyboard slamming anything like a furnace going anything like a car i know you want a quiet environment to begin with let's go ahead and break all these urns just to make sure that uh i have all the opportunities of trying to get my health back so i'm going to try to break all these urns with the five percent chance of getting health i gotta break them just to make sure i get some of my health back yeah i'm always i don't understand what it is that they are doing better and or different compared to what i am doing so i you know i think it really does just have to be the post processing or something you know or the not post processing but um just what they do afterwards you know like like the editing you know it's got to be something that they do in post in editing you know and i'm not exactly sure what it is that they could even be doing because you know i know on a lot of stuff whenever i try to look up stuff like this people always say oh you just gotta normalize you gotta normalize like no normalizing makes the quiets loud and the louds quieter it trying to normalize the audio format you know the audio wave and also why do you keep on dodging in front of the laser beam i'm trying to dodge across the pit dodge across the pit please thank you thank you my god okay um <laughs> but it's i i don't know because normalizing does not do that i don't know it can't be just like sound dampening that you have on the walls you know I, if anything i just need a way to maybe bring the microphone further away from where i am using my keyboard but then if the microphone is too far away it almost sounds like the room just just gets echoey because you're talking too far away to the microphone it's, it's literally just so far away from you that ooh, plus 50 i don't want to waste the health capabilities now let's just go into the next room and upgrade our weapon but you know if you end up being too far away from the mic it's just going to get echoey the further and further away you go because it's just going to sound like you were a further away in the room talking to it you know and it just doesn't sound good but I don't know how everyone else tends to do this. Usually, I, when I see their microphones, it is right up on their face, right up on their mouth, you know, right above the, like, their desk, right where they record everything in front of their monitor. So, I just, 
to anyone who is maybe watching this who your attack use special is more sturdy well we while we use an attack i'm sturdy so 30 percent less damage while i'm like always hitting your dash upper deals 100 damage in the area whenever your slave foes restore wait whenever your special slaves foes restore two percent my this restores two percent of my health oh my god hello that is amazing i just have something i can just automatically restore my health in any format if i get a whole bunch of numb skulls i can just sit there and just kind of farm the numb skulls and get health back that way well i'm gonna go ahead and take aries as our first choice here because uh i like aries i like the blade rift abilities i like that he has like base formats to just your attack percentage and pretty much why take damage inflict doom on foes around you and doom effects do more damage when applied multiple times Ooh, da bonus damage per stack so i can cast that multiple times i mean considering that my attack in general does doom damage if i can stack that multiple times with my attack rate that's just gonna be amazing i'm just gonna be stacking on a bunch a whole bunch of damage on top of them oh athena's a little bit angry that you know we chose you know oh hello that we oh and it makes it makes them in, invulnerable okay okay and yeah wow that doom is uh really really stacking up my god hello you have no health left that is cheating good sir that is cheating <laughs> also there are a lot of a lot of projectiles going around here i got all the dark wizard money gangs here where's that one with like with no health is he still hiding over here somewhere no okay come on get on you get on you you've got to be taken down you are done where is the last guy you just hiding in the corner yeah and now you're impervious just give it a moment kind of zoom around wait for his attack yep now stun him against the wall beautiful nice i like the ones where i don't have to worry about getting chased down by the god Bones forgiven exacting vengeance is just something we olympians all do from time to time uh, that's just something you just do from time to time exact revenge i'm sorry what uh your dash deals damage and can deflect that device restores more health and your special is stronger and can deflect i mean i kind of want your dash deals damage and can deflect because that means anytime i you know dash into a projectile it's just going to deflect it for me which is you know that's i tend to do quite a bit i'm gonna go ahead and take some re free restore of health right there and we have 300 gold i'm not gonna bother with emergent just yet i may as well just go for a power up because we need to be more powerful in general now okay i kind of want to do that your doom deals more damage plus 85 percent yes yes we are starting to stack up a lot of doom damage here so this actually might be super super good for like bosses i'm kind of interested to see how what we end up doing against meg this time around you know that is if it is you know even going to be a mega it sounded like last time where like she's getting kind of sick and tired of, like battling us <laughs> you know and they mentioned before something about her like sisters oh hey we've got knuckle nice a knuckle head very good very good all right well let's see what meg meg what do you got for us are you are you prepared to lose again because i have all... hello i i called it i called it <laughs> Well, yeah, I, I killed a lot of people to get here. Hey, you must be one of Meg's sisters. Nice to finally meet you. My name is Agrius. Not murderer. Definitely not. Well, I mean, I mean, questionable. You must be Charon's, like, daughter or something, because you two would get along great. You just kind of, like, make mumbling noises. Um, look, I've done some things that maybe aren't great, but... I am very, very sure I haven't murdered anyone. All right, enlightening conversation. <laughs> Gonna lay off my calf there because remember from last episode, we found out that we actually do extra. Oh, I got stunned. We do extra damage to uh to enemies that have the runes inside them. Move out of the way of that. They have the runes inside them. Well, I think for each one that's inside an enemy, they take 10% extra damage, something like that. So right now, if I get all three inside of her, yeah, there we go. It actually does 30% extra damage inside of her. Now, whenever I hit her, oh God, get out of the way of that. A lot of projectiles, deflect all those, which I got to say, by the way, I'm doing so much damage to her and she is a boss. You know, this doom is really just stacking up on top. Wait for that doom to take effect. Yeah, that just took away like 10% of her health with that when that doom kind of struck down and takes her out with the delayed hit. Beautiful. Yeah, that Doom is going to be a real good boss killer. I think we got some great we got some great moves going on here. As my phone goes off, I am a great YouTuber. I know what I'm doing. Audio quality. I was just talking about audio quality, and yet I consistently always forget to turn off my phone. You know, like, because you when you start recording, like, Discord automatically puts you in, um, Discord automatically puts you in what they call streamer mode. 
So that basically just means that it disables all the notifications and things that can, you know, come through on Discord, but it doesn't do that on your phone. It does it on your computer, you know? <laughs> so uh, I always often forget about that one. Um, I kind of just, I mean, I, I don't really want any of these. Honestly, not going to lie. I, I don't want to waste my gold on any of those. Uh, they didn't really seem that particularly good. I would have liked to get something that has like maybe more attack damage, a little bit more special damage, whatever it is, but whatever have you. So, hey, those of you, if, if you guys are not familiar with it, I have been working on a music video and I am progressively getting closer and closer. I made a community post about it recently, too, where I have been getting very, you know, close to finishing the storyboard of the, um, of the music video because basically every single verse i'm trying to think of all the transitional thoughts i'm trying to think of all the different angles all the different like scenes that i want to put in the music video so i've been trying to make a storyboard in general of just like how i want to like just really you know make it you know i've been trying to put down my imagination down on paper and color coding the entire situation color coding all the scenes so i know exactly what i'm looking at I'm going to be trying to get some of my friends to help me out with some of these shots because, you know, sometimes you just need some of these these cool shots that I have in my mind. You just need somebody else there to help you with it. And I got one scene where, like, I'm going to be running down a road and, like, stop and they got to, like, zoom in to me. It's like, you just need another person to help you with some of this stuff. I would not be able to do most of this, if not any of this, all by myself. Like, I, I, I'm thinking of all the scenes and stuff by myself. That's fine. I'm making it pretty much entirely by myself. But I'm still going to need another set of hands even to just get the shots that I'm thinking of because I, I'm not standing in the lava. I was right on the edge. I was right on the edge. Don't give me that. <laughs> okay, yep, yeah, that doom. Oh my god, that's stacking up so well. Have I given you any, uh, I have given you some ambrosia. I'm trying to save what I have for, you know, for new people that I haven't given it to. Try to get their little items. I heard me I love you. You talk just like me. <laughs> you, you both drop the stuck in them faster. You can dash more times now in a row. Ooh, ooh. I mean, I kind of want them to drop things that are stuck in them. Actually, no, I don't because the longer that they're in them, the more damage that they can take while it's inside them. And I kind of don't really want my special being faster either. As much as they'd be good for, you know, being faded choices, I'm going to go ahead and just take the dash in a row because now I can get out of the area, get more out of, you know, damage you know get out of danger with danger's way a little bit faster with that going on over to a zeus which honestly i don't think we've seen a zeus spoon in a while even from last episode compared to even this episode we haven't seen a lot of a lot of zeus spoons at all oh come on come on land on down land on down why don't you beautiful and look at how much damage i'm gonna do i'm gonna do some hits there that did 250 for that doom that is crazy that is crazy oh i couldn't dodge out of the way in time <laughs> i saw him coming and i just couldn't do it <laughs> i couldn't get out of the way in time but if I use my special, this should heal me, right? They said that it heals by 2%. Have I given you an Abrosia? I have not. Mr. Zeus, my man. I kind of swear I gave you one, like, early on. But I guess not. Lord Zeus, um, uncle, please accept this offering and all my gratitude. You, is Zeus is my uncle? Yeah, I guess, no, that, that kind of plays out. You know, that makes sense. Goodness, nephew, that's an offering indeed. I'm thankful for your piety to me. And as a show of generosity to you, in turn, I present this. Oh, what do you got for me, Uncle Z? You know, hey, from one Z to another, Thunder Signet. Ooh, we're gonna have to take a we're gonna have to take a quick look at some of these uh some of these you know items that they've been giving us once we're done here with the run as well. I'm sure there's gonna be like dialogue waiting for us. I tried to mash him up with some more wholesome types, but no, and here we are. Okay, hang on. Zeus, I don't want to hear anything about matching you up with wholesome types. Zeus, you are basically the god of all Ds. Like, you are, you are, you are the dick down god of all gods. Like, you cannot keep your dick out of, like, anything. So, I'm not going to take any type of relationship advice or, you know, your own opinionated version of, you know, wholesome women that you might call. That's, uh... No, Zeus, you do not want to trust his advice on any of that. After you take damage, your foe is struck by lightning. Your call makes you lightning right strike to nearby foes. Your special cause lightning bolt to strike nearby enemies. I'm going to do the call. Seems kind of nice. Just kind of something I can build up staggerly in the background. Prophecy foretold. Ooh, what do I want to go for? I don't want health. I don't really want the merchant. I, I want Ares. I want the mini boss Ares because a mini boss, first of all, is going to give you a better rarity of a boon. And, you know, this, the mini bosses in this, you know, Floor are not that difficult this the barge really isn't that bad if you're just a little bit you know more methodical about it try to take out you know this thing that's about to blow up wait for it and boom look at all that damage that just hit him right there that is just try to be a little bit more methodical about it be a little bit smarter watch that doom fall down oh my god yeah i do little to no damage but holy crap if, if it's not that doom that does a lot of my what i need here hit him in the back get that to fall down yeah yeah 
Okay, go ahead and activate my my runes. Oh, God, they all have armor? Hello? Oh, Jesus. Okay, that might be a little bit more difficult. Um, let me get out of here a little bit. I'm trying to get out of the area. Let the Doom just try to stack up on their own. Get rid of the crystal that's making them impervious. And look at that. I think I made through it that mini boss without even taking a single hit. I Didn't I lose to this once in the very first episode or take a lot of damage from this? After Death Defiance, deal more damage to that encounter. After slaying a foe, your next attack or special deals more damage. Ooh. I mean, I, I kind of want the Death Defiance one because chances are I'm probably going to go down in the final fight against, you know, Hades, my father. And if I can get a sudden 15% extra boost to my health, or well, not health, my attack damage afterwards, that might just be exactly what I need to finally clutch it up in the end, you know, for a win. But let's not forget that I do actually get health or have a chance to get health out of these urns. So I am down a little bit of health, so try to keep an eye out for all these urns. And just like that, boom, plus seven, I'm at max. Nice. I think they give you up to 10 is the maximum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Move out away from that. You know, I don't even need to be using my special. I don't need health back. I don't need that 2% restore. Um, yeah, okay, these, oh god, hello, oh, god, they just all jumped in, they just all jumped in on me, stay out of the lava, please, would you? Oh, that delay is very nice, allows me to hit them, watch it as they all get low health, and then get the heck out of the area, because they are all about to blow up when they go down, move out of the way, <laughs> move out of that way, uh, try to take out this one that has a little bit of health left, so I can focus down on the one guy with armor, nice, nice, there we go. So, hey, I hope you guys have been really enjoying the Hades series. You know, we did have that competition week, and this is kind of the primary reason as to why we are doing this to begin with, because, you know, the competition week, you know, Hades did double, it did the best. In second place was Isaac, and Isaac only got like 400 some views, and Hades got like plus 800. So, you know, it was very, it was a very, you know, obvious, like, who was the winner, but Isaac did get a lot more interaction in the comments and kind of like helpful, you know, nuances and stuff to it. And hey, we're going straight from a free room into a merchant. Oh, that is going to be beautiful. That's like a free run. And we get a fish. Hello. And it's a golden looking fish. Can I catch this? Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Come on. Come on. Ooh, you're a tease. A crustacean. Yeah. A crustanean. Very nice. Ooh. Hello there, Karan. What do you have for us? Ooh, we have a free... Wait, well, not a free, but a boon right here waiting for us. Any damage you deal is a chance to be critical. Your foes take damage when you have stuck on them and is dislodged. So they basically just like another 100 damage of them. When I apply three to them, they're going to get like 300 damage when they kind of dislodge themselves. I would kind of like the idea of a critical chance, but a 2% critical chance is not that good considering the fact that I can get like a free 300 as much as I want to with that one. So take the max life, take the darkness, why not? Take all these pots and pans, break all these, why not? You know, I don't even need that health. Karen, what do you got to say? Karen, I'm sorry. Say a thousand coins. Would you be willing to give me a ride in your beautiful boat? Up river, I should say, specifically. I mean, I could probably get to a thousand coins if I needed to by like the final floor. Yeah, you and uh you and whoever that was that was speaking murder earlier, she's gotta be your daughter. You two are like two peas in a pod. That is beautiful. <laughs> And hey, I just remembered that we are actually getting all the diamonds, we're getting all the Titan blood, and we're getting all the kind of rewards of defeating these these bosses because we've never used the gloves before. Remember me, Hydra? What do you? Oh, you know, honestly, that's just rude. So let's just go ahead and put my crystals in him. Nice, he did his attack there. He's probably about to do it again. Yep, move out of the way. We have him slam down on the ground. Oh, that's right. I can deflect these with my with my dash. <laughs> just deflect those right on back to him. Why don't we get out of the way? He doesn't seem to be hitting multiple times. It seems to be pretty straightforward. Nice. And the crystals should be falling out. They did fall out. So get out of the way of his projectile because he launches all kind of an orange wave. They all do really like that slamming down on the ground effects because that is pretty effective when you're up close like that. So look at that. Look at that. He is nearly dead and the doom gets him. Oh, that is nice. Okay, go ahead and try to focus on the last hydra. He's about to slam a little bit. Nope. Okay, oh, and there he is. Yeah, no, okay, the slam was very delayed. I thought that was going to happen a lot sooner, but I suppose not. Try to get those ruins inside him. He's about to slam down as well. Get out of the way. Yep, there you go. He kind of went in the opposite direction. And funny enough, move it out of the way. He's about to do a whole bunch of projectiles. Yep, 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 yep. Nice. Managed to dodge all those and dodge that. He's going to hit the ground a few times in a row. Just scream, why don't you? Drop me my runes. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there we go, there we go. I wanted to be... A little bit cautious about this entire scenario. Try to focus on these two while they're close up and bunched together like that. Nice. Get my rune into him. He's going to be launching a couple of attacks real soon. Yep, there it is. Nice. Take it slow. Take it slow. Get rid of his... Oh, come on. Come on. I was sitting there punching the air directly for that projectile. And you saying that it didn't deflect it. 
Now that is what I call bogus. That's what I call bogus. Get out of the lava, please. Why don't you? And deflect that with my little dash there. Nice. Okay, I can just stand here. I don't even need to keep on dashing, right? I can just stand here and punch him. Yeah, there we go. I can just stand there and punch him. You know, why don't I just do that then? Honestly, why don't I go ahead and use my greater call here too? Because the actual Hydra itself is not difficult. The only difficult part of the real boss battle is the fact that there are just not a whole lot of room as there is a lot of stuff going on all at the same time. Try to get this guy down. Nice. He's about to do some more hits or projectiles. So I'll stay out of the way. Stay out of the way. Play it slow. Play it slow. Don't want to be dangerous. And taken out. Yeah. It turns out when you take your time, you play better. Wow. Surprising. I know. And hey, I'm even thinking. I feel like I did really well last time in terms of not doing any commentary but playing this game. Do you guys like that? Did you enjoy the kind of format where you just watch me actually just play the game? You know, it can be kind of nice for these longer roguelikes, you know, where you just kind of just want to see what the entire, like, what happens, you know, just try to see if I can survive the run. I did surpass the Hydra. You should, you should do something about that. Oh, I don't need to restore any health. Don't need the gems. Gain one crystal for my cast. For six encounters that's eh, not worth 50 gold that's just kind of a waste uh what do we have here so i am 33 encounters from ranking this up again it seems really really helpful because as much as getting 25 health is really nice with you know the collar what's the point when you can just heal back all that 25 health and you know in general because i've been consistently trying to stay near the top because there are a lot of urns in this game like there are urns all over the place so with how many there are just sitting around on the ground, you may as well just try to use the one that allows you a percentage chance of getting more. And my God, if I, I've only been recording for like 26 minutes and we are already on the final floor. Like this actually is going so much faster. And we get a weapon upgrade. We either have a choice of gold or a weapon upgrade. I'm going to take the weapon upgrade. So let's hope that this entire scenario stays a little bit more, you know, faithful because I, this is definitely, of course, it is the final floor, so it is, you know, going to be more difficult, but I always struggle a little bit with this floor, simply because of the archers. You know, the archers, I have to keep an eye out when they're aiming at you. You'll see that they have, like, little aiming reticule on you that zooms in, gets red, and then the kamikaze is not going to be good for my, you know, for my build. Ah, don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare. God, no, see, that's the bow. That's the bow I was talking about. That's the bow. <laughs> He's about to fire it. And some of them seem to fire three times in a row. So uh, they really try to get you on that. Nice. Take him out. Be slow. Be slow. Don't run into a trap. There we go. Your dash strike pierces bows and deals 900% damage to armor. Hello? Your attack has more range and deals plus 10% damage. Your dash strike deals 60% damage added to attack sequence. Ah, uh, these are all so good. I would really like the armor one because... That's going to make fighting all these, you know, minions much easier. However, that's not going to help me with the boss. Plus 10% is kind of good for a boss, but my dash strike dealing 60% extra more damage added to the attack sequence. Press or hold to use your main weapon. Press dash and space immediately, then press attack. To, yeah, plus 60%. I mean, I'm dashing around all the time. Like this, this is, I'd rather take a 60% chance increase to everything instead of a base 10%, right? I mean... Especially since this may as well be a 60% base, you know, impulse because that is just how much I dash around with this thing. I can't necessarily see that I'm doing a whole lot more damage here. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell, like, when you're moving around a lot, especially since it is having to do with dash damage. So I have to dash to even, you know, do it to begin with. But if I just go, yeah, I mean, honestly, it seems to be doing pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and just trust the fact that, you know, I'm definitely doing more compared to what it was before. But, you know, if my dash strike was only like 40 to like 45 damage, plus 60% is only going to give me, you know, somewhere along the range of getting up to like 60 damage per hit. Now, I got these guys cornered really well. Oh, my God. <laughs> I just, I got you guys stunned up in the side here. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus, I absolutely wrecked it on that one. Holy crap. Um, I don't want them to drop faster. God gauge your feeling automatically is kind of nice. After using a call, gain dodge chance and move speed for 10 seconds. 30%? I mean... I guess. Yeah, I, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll be, I'm definitely using it again for the bosses. Do I want to shop for anything? Uh, sure. Chaos Gate. Sure. Random item. 45 gold for that. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to take the double, the double mini boss. Or not the double mini boss. The, the double boon here. Again, even though it is, it is more difficult. Oh God. What do I, do I want Zeus or Ares? Ugh, I kind of, I want Ares again. I want Ares again. I really like Ares because it's just more attack damage typically. You know, like your special inflicts do, your attack and special do more damage. Yeah, that's just a 10% base damage after you take damage inflict doom on foes around you. 100 damage every time I take damage. 
I mean, yeah, again, for the boss, I'm probably beginning hit by Hades a lot by my father. My father is going to beat my ass real hard. My father is going to abuse me. My dad has been hitting me. When I get up to the top and I, when I leave the home, when I leave my hell home, literally my home is hell. So when I get to leave my home, that is just absolute hell. My father beats me into submission and sends me back down to that whole hell hole. Literally, my father beats me into hell. <laughs> Zagreus, I feel sorry for you, my man. <laughs> now, I'm a little scared. I'm sorry, Zeus. Well, one of you are going to be mad at me. I'd rather have you mad at me than the God of War mad at me. But I don't like Zeus because he calls down a whole bunch of lightning, I believe. And it's a little bit harder to dodge. I might take a, quite a few hits here. Yeah, look at all that. Look at all that that's going up in the air. Oh my god. Even when I hit these guys in the shield, I, I think I think the doom still applies. It looks like. Okay, I need oh ah. <laughs> I need to move out of the way. Okay, yeah, I I, I god I hate these shield dudes so much. You know, it would have been nice if I could do 900 percent extra damage to armor. Move out of the way, move out of the way. Let's just be casual about it. Don't need to rush. They're doing their projectiles. Don't need to rush. Don't need to rush. Be careful about it. Nice. Hit these guys in the back. Move out of the way. There is a delay between each round before he does another one. Nice. Okay. There should be a couple more enemies here. Please, no more shields. Dodge his ability. Okay. Uh, only one more shield. That's not... No, two more shields. I lied. I lied to you. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and just throw my cast here. I don't know why I'm not doing that a little bit more often because remember, it is AoE. So that does build up kind of nicely on here. I'm going to use my ability. Maybe was will use my call... Yeah, I'm going to use Zeus's call to defeat Zeus. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, yeah, it'll probably happen again. My bad. Your lightning bolt effects deal damage in a larger area, so my call can be good. Your god gate charges up faster while when you deal or take damage. Oh, yeah, I'm doing a lot of damage. That's going to make my god gauge feel super fast. Um... I guess, you know, let's go ahead. Let's take, let's take a, uh, let's take a, um, a Zeus mini boss. I could have gone for that treasure trove there, but I'm kind of just trying to run on through this. Thank you. I would love to have a fair fight instead of having to take both of you guys on at the same time. Get you doing that. Nice. I managed to deflect that. So yeah, this this dodge to actually deflect is a godsend because that is actually helping me. When you dodge in the middle of his attack, it ends up deflecting instead of taking any damage. Hit him in the back. Hit him in the back. Nice. He's jumping around. He's jumping around. Backstab him. Backstab him. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Go ahead and use my... Oh, God. I couldn't even see him. He's off screen. <laughs> I couldn't see him. Okay, I didn't even realize I'm at 66 health. When did that happen? I guess it must have been the shields. I did take quite a few hits that last uh, that last encounter in the room. That They did do quite a bit to me. Okay, dodge out of the way. Nice, nice. I can't believe. Oh, God. <laughs> he keeps on running at me. No, no, dodge out of the way. Dodge out of the way. Make sure I'm actually hitting him, too. I keep on smacking him in the wrong direction. Okay, yeah, stack it up, stack it up, stack it up. Move out of the way. No. I'm going to use my call. Oh, he is done? At a quarter health? Does that mean I still got to face you in the next room? I beat the bull of Minos. You did beat the bull of Minos. A Minos. Hear me, on my authority. Hear me roar. <laughs> Your lightning effects also make enemies jolted. Jolt damage. So on top of my call doing a bunch of damage to them, they also take 114 extra for bolt being jolted. Uh, bolt effects deal damage in a large area. Bolt area of effect 84%. Don't really need their special cause of lightning bolt to strike down nearby foes. I'm going to do jolted. Because again, I'm you're trying to build this all up for essentially verse in Hades here. You, this is, you, have to, you have to build yourself up for the final boss battle at this point. Because anything but is just going to be you know setting yourself up for failure if you don't try to aim for that right now. So something that does extra damage in terms of like jilted there is just more stackables on top of already stackables. You know, try. Oh my God, he has a double attack and he just hit me hard. Oh my God, I'm at 38 health. Okay, yeah, I told you this. This floor gives me a lot of a lot of trouble because I just I take so many hits. There's so many enemies that are just complicated to really just use the rights. 
And he yeah, gets hit by the arrow. Nice. There's just so many enemies that seem to just have such weird... You know, they're, they're hard to dodge moves. Like, you know, these guys really like to lunge at you. That guy, the shield guy, not only deflects attacks, but he also has a spinning attack and he has a ranged attack. Like, those shield guys are a little broken. Not gonna lie. Like, they're, they're a little bit OP in terms of an enemy. Like, they are kind of like the number one enemy on this floor. If, if it weren't for them, I feel like I'd be doing 10 times better. But hey, that is the name of the game. I just gotta get good, you know? Hey, remember that point that started the video where I said I was gonna try to talk less and then I started, started talking about the fact that I think I was failing at it? Yeah, I can realize, uh, objective failed today. <laughs> objective failed. And I don't know if I will ever be able to do that. It's just too much ingrained to how I am. A 30, or 43 health restored for 34 gold? Now that is pretty decent. Next boom will be having upgraded rarity? Yeah, sure, why not? Upgraded rarity seems pretty good. I mean, especially if the next rarity is going to be really good. Oh, let's go. Let's go for the merchant. I'll take a free room. You know, a free room is always going to be good. That just means I'm not going to take any damage, you know. Oh, and a little bit of health. Oh, my God. Uh, I'm going to take an Ares upgrade. It should be upgraded uh, rarity. It feels unseemly to make contact from that most unpleasant boatman's stash of ill-gotten wares. Nonetheless, this was an opportunity. Hello there, Athena. Are you, are you mad about having to do this through Charon or Charon? I always, I can never pronounce his name correctly. Um, so we do get rares. Resist damage from traps. Your abilities can deflect. Also make enemies exposed. Ooh, so my dash that does damage and deflects also makes them exposed, which means they can take 63% extra backstabbing damage. Oh, yes. Oh, now that, now we're talking, boys. I mean, honestly, there are lots of moments of now we talking, but now we really talking. Like, if we were talking before, I'm talking even more now. That's right. If that's even going to be even possible, I don't know, but we are doing it. <laughs> now, because now we're talking. Yeah, see, look at that. They're going to expose. They're taking extra backstabbing damage. Oh, my God. That is actually a huge, huge surplus to damage right there. I can tell that their health is dropping down much faster. Oh, my God. That is a god's... Actually, yeah. It is a godsend. These are the god's boons. Yeah, it is a godsend. I mean, that's not even a play of words. That's just me realizing that I'm just saying exactly what it is. You know, it, you know <laughs> what else What else am I going to... What else to call it? May as well activate my call there immediately. Try to get all those guys hurt up while with the area of effect. Because the lightning does seem to have a little bit of AoE to it when it strikes down. So when they're all kind of grouped up like that, it's a nice moment to just, yeah, really just take them all out. Take this power up. My attack flicks doom. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that because your doom effects deal more damage. I mean, that's going to be nice, an extra 15%. But what's the point of that when I can get 85% to my 105? So that's going to give more base damage to everything for my doom. Oh my god. And a little bit of health. We are sitting at full. And why do we need darkness when we can take a free room? And oh, hello. Wait. Honestly, I don't know what this room is. I barely hear him. He's whispering. Who are you? Go on, stranger. Plenty more shades looking to fight with you out there. I'm just passing through. You seem less warlike than the rest. May I ask your name, sir? I'm Zagreus. Names are there to be forgotten, stranger. You shouldn't be here. May the fates favor your journey. But just in case they don't, here. Why don't you take this? Uh, okay, stranger. That's sitting in the dungeon all along. Um, I replenish all death defiances. Well, I didn't go. I didn't go through any. For the next five chambers, restore thirty percent when you enter a chamber. Oh my god. Who's my boys? For the next ten accounts, your attack deals sixty percent extra damage. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the sixty percent extra damage. Also, I see this little dialogue over here. Amid Elysium's moss-covered chambers, carved of stone, stand untold numbers of eternal monuments in tribute to the greatest heroes which mortality can offer. There to honor them in life as well as death. You know, I really appreciate all the voice acting because my God, it means that I don't have to do all this because you know that every single time, all the voice is just gonna be exactly the same. Amid Elysium's moss-covered chambers, carved in stone, stand untold numbers of eternal monuments. It's just, I'm just going to do a deep voice for all of it, you know? <laughs> you know, I try to drop my voice down a little bit when I'm trying to do, like, maybe, like, the regular episodes, but for, like, an hour-long episode, it gets a little difficult to do. Um, I'll take a power-up. I, you know, the, a free merchant room would be nice. Oh, we get a free room anyway. Nice, yeah, okay, give me the power-up. Um... Let's see, your cast damage is in a small area and can't deflect your call, does more damage. Your abilities that can deflect can also make more exposed. I maybe 
Uh, I mean, Zeus's A could be really good for just maximizing a crap ton of damage. But you know what? I think this is going to be better because having enemies consistently exposed and taking more damage from behind, I think it's be a little bit more beneficial than anything. But all right, we're about to go verse. Uh, we're about to go verse the the bull Minotaurs. And what's his name again? What's, it, what's your name again? Good sir. Thesis. You seek to break through to the surface of the world, but you shall not achieve your goal whilst I yet live and breathe, or the equivalent of it here in the splendors of Elysium. Yeah, we're gonna have to fix that. I don't, I don't think I'll be breathing much longer, my man. And you leave me with little choice but to make you shut up already, and your bullheaded manservant there. Ooh, he called him out. Hugh Zagris, he got him. That Minotaur whom you address is my dear friend, you preconceiving stain upon the earth. <laughs> and I are brothers here in death as we were enemies in life. Not that you could ever understand fraternal bonds as strong as ours. Yeah, I don't even have a dad that loves me, so of course I don't understand. <laughs> oh, look at that. The, uh, the, the, the Minotaur, -tor, the Mini Tartar, -tar is actually a reduced health already. He's actually missed about a quarter of his health because we fought him earlier. That is a nice touch to detail there. That actually helps us out quite, quite a bit. Dude, oh my God, look at all much damage I'm doing this guy. I'm just, I'm just sort of destroying him. I just okay. I need to yeah, move out of the way. I'm just destroying him. Get the runes back in him. Get all the extra stuff back in. Let's not stay in front of him. Do the backstabbing. He's about to do his area of effect hits. Don't want to be in the way of when that happens. What are you doing? Why is he just standing on the ground like that? That was weird. Um, I'm gonna activate my call. Nice, 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 nice. nice. I want to take this guy out. Come on, get him. Get the mini tartar. Get the mini, 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 mini tartar. <laughs> Come on, yes. I asked. Oh, and I can deflect his spear. I can deflect his spear with my da with my uh with my dashing. Oh my god! <laughs> Into the face. Just keep on smacking him in the shield. Just smack him in the shield. Oh, what? You were facing the other direction. You're facing the other direction. You can't do that. That's cheating. Here's my call. Just take a bunch of damage, why don't you? Just take a whole bunch. Yeah, just stay near him enough so it does a whole lot to him. I'll get rid of that imperviousness. Yeah, take a few more hits. Why don't you? Oh, hello, hello, hello. Dodge all that. Dodge all that. Throw all of my runes. It does in a blocking into him. My God, hello. <laughs> that was close. Okay, thank God that my ability to deflect with my dash is a real lifesaver. Literally, cause it is saving my life. Saving my life, stand in the middle. <laughs> saving my life. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was close. That was close. He, oh, I think he may have actually did a little bit of damage to that last one. I'm missing a bit there. He may have still hit me. <laughs> I just helped myself. I've got a fan. I've got a shade over here. One of the shades actually support me. Oh, oh, I love him. I love him like he has a little banner out for me in front. Everyone's got the Minotaur. He's got the thesis, but no, I, he's got a banner for me. I love you, Shade. I love you long time. <laughs> All right, let's get into the final area of the run. My God, we are doing great. Restore 50 here. Uh, look at the shop. I don't want to restore up to 35. Maybe extra damage to like armor. Uh, nah, but I will take an increased rarity to these boons because we're about to come into the room where we have like four or five different choices to go down. And some of them are probably gonna be mini bosses, but with them being mini bosses, it automatically upgrades the rarity. But because it's automatically upgrading the rarity and I have another thing that upgrades the rarity, I'm almost guaranteed like, like an actual like super rare boon almost. So I'm kind of excited to see exactly what we have here. Lots of urns also get some free health at 121. Anything else? No, not quite. All right. Into the final area. What do we got? Uh, 450, 150, 150, 300 and 500. Yeah, I'm severely lacking in, in any gold to buy any of that stuff. My God. The vast temple of sticks and its innumerable dangers now are all that separates the underworld prince from the land outside, which he so desperately longs to see. Innumerable, innumerable dangers. Now, isn't that a nice like little ring to it? We have a fishing spot here. Yeah, fishing time. You know, I play games to fish. Ah. Oh, okay. God, that was quick. A scuffer. I got a scuffer. I got a scuffer. I'm about to get all scuffed up, I tell you what. Okay, so yeah, because we have an increased rarity. Really? Really? The game's gonna do me like that? Wow. Uh, the two mini bosses are on gold and health. It didn't do it for the boons. That is, that is, that's disappointing. All right, well, let's go do Ares then, I suppose. You know, because you know, we could have gotten a super rare, you know, kind of boon. But no, it, it said that these are just going to be regular rooms. No mini boss rooms for the boons. So, uh, okay, it is what it is. 
you know what? You can't win everything, at least because we did get that. We were not going to get like a regular common kind of upgrade. No, we should be. Ooh, okay, I need to stay out of that poison, though. I don't know how to get around that. I don't exactly have any range to my attacks. I have a little bit of range, I guess. Just barely enough to stay out of it. Yeah, there we go. Nice. And we do heal a little bit each time we enter a chamber, too. So these rooms can be not too bad, considering the fact that we, there are so many rooms. You just keep on healing up every time you come into a new room. Just a little bit, because like, I took three damage there. And now when I go into the new room, I'm going to heal back three damage. But it doesn't matter, because we got a little bit of health sitting here. Yeah. You know, I, I think I was talking about this earlier, though. I kind of forgot when you know, skipped over the whole, you know, rest of the rant. Is that, um, you know, hey, I am working on the music video. I am nearly done. Oh, God, I'm poisoned. I'm poisoned. Okay, get the healing. Um, It is nearly complete. I've been doing it basically while I've been at work, you know, because I've had a lot of downtime at work lately. So I've been being able to actually use that time to my advantage to try to... Oh, God, he's about to launch lasers. Oh, I lost my cover. Okay, well, the cover just disappeared suddenly. Um, <laughs> Get rid of your lasers, please, good sir. That is... What? I, okay, well, I thought that was going to fire something out, like some projectiles, but no, it just it just drops down a whole bunch of, like, axes and just hurts you. Uh, get that gear. These guys are not taking a lot of damage. Oh, my God, I got hurt again? Uh, I need to get this gear. Yep, I got hurt again. Okay, need to stay out of the way of all these explosives. These guys are not taking any damage. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I have been, um, I've been working on the storyboarding wall. I've been at work, so I've been using it. I should be finished with it probably by Friday, which is going to be nice. I'm going to be trying to record a lot of the stuff over the weekend and try to get some of the stuff ready. The revenge effects sometimes occur without taking damage. Auto revenge rate, three seconds. Okay, but what's the percentage on that? Do I want a 13% damage increase? Do so I special inflicts doom? Or do I just want maybe an auto just kind of revenge ability? So if I take a look at my boons... I think I have a, after you take damage, inflict doom by 100 damage. So, I mean, I guess every three seconds if it has the ability to just automatically just do a 300 damage. Sure, why not? I guess we'll take it. Uh, but this was not the room that we were looking for. You know, these are not the droids you're looking for. But this was also not the room we were looking for. Oh, uh, may as well go on towards, I kind of want the health. Not going to lie, I kind of want the health. We are a little low here. And if we can get a little bit more health to try to get into the final room without using Adept Defiance, that could be pretty good, considering that the final room does actually have a healing fountain. And on top of that, we also have something like this. Yeah, okay, the next... Then a 15% chance to drop health over the next few encounters. I'm going to take that just to try to get back some of our health here. We want to be coming into the very final battle with as much as possible. If not anything, just try to be completely full, actually. Uh, let me go ahead and use my... I need to keep on remembering how to use my runes. Because if I'm not throwing those in, they're just not taking as much damage as they could be. There we go. Yeah. Now we're sitting pretty. Right, 79 health out of 125. Because this is a boss... Oh, God. Oh, God. Because this is a mini boss reward for health, I think it'll give us 50 instead of our regular 25. Maybe it'll just be like 35. I forget. Oh, we found the room. Nice. Yeah, plus 50. Oh, my God. And restores 70. Oh, we're sitting at 175. Oh, we are sitting at 175 for health. That is amazing. Within the desecrated layer of the god defiling satyrs lie the noisome contents of their profane rituals, so foul as to be indescribable. Indescribable. Like what, just sacrifices? I mean, that seems pretty describable. I mean, okay, let's go see what we can do. How much gold do we have? We have 117. Can I get anything with that? I can't afford anything with that. Well, all right, Digities, let's. This is it. We are going to be giving this one more try. Again accepts the sack. Yeah. Bye bye, doggy. Bye, Cerberus. <laughs> there we go. He's fine. Cerberus vanquished. Well, father, I think this might just be the one. I'm prepared to do this because I have to deflect with my dodge. I have all these doom kick abilities. I can automatically do revenge. I am prepared to actually win this. I will beat my father. You will not hit me into submission. I will win this fight, father. I will go see my mother. Coming back. You can't keep me on all the weekends. <laughs> the sea, the heavens and the earth. All of this belongs to my brothers. We are their kin by birth. But we are foreigners in their country. No. No mournful speeches. Now get out of my way. You impertinent brat. Fine. Impulsiveness runs in the family. This dagger is like, I've heard enough of your bullshit. Let's fight. <laughs> shut up. Yeah, shut up. I don't want to hear anything you got to say. Let me beat your ass. <laughs> God, I hope I hope that I'm not going to get automatically demonetized because of all the strong profanity in this episode. 
Okay, let's let's not be let's not be overly cocky. Let's use my dashes effectively. Let's not try to take any unnecessary damage. Cause he hit me like what once there, and I already lost like what 30 health with that single hit. That is a lot, you know. Let's use my dashes effectively because if I can deflect here, then I may as well. They are essentially just a free dodge. They are a free imperviousness to any attack that's gonna be hitting me. Nice. He's already a quarter of the way down. Oh god, oh god, okay. Go ahead and take out some of these enemies that are up in the area. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, he does manage to hit me though, unfortunately. That did, what, 2, 15? Oh god, god, okay, you know what? Time to activate my, my call. Why don't we just do a whole bunch. Take out all these enemies in the area. Take out all these little scrubs. These, uh, what do they call them? Um, god, oh, I'm taking so much. How am I taking so much? God, I don't even remember taking that many hits. I know I got hit a few times, but I'm already down to 20. Oh, come on, this has got to be the run. This has got to be the run that I actually win. <laughs> this has got to be the run, right? Right? There's no way that we're going to lose something like this because we're we're so powerful. We're doing so well. I don't know if we could lose this. Come on now. Come on. Let's let's be let's be mindful about where I'm going. What hurt me? What? I'm already using a death defiance? I don't know what hurt me there. I have honestly no clue what the heck just did that. Okay. Well, you know, whatever. Whatever, let's, what just hurt me? Okay, that hurt me, but I I so destroyed that in time. I was doing so much damage to it. How did that not be destroyed in time? Okay, that one's about to activate. Get out of the way. There we go, there we go. This stupid little, God, this stupid little worm that keeps on popping up around. There you are. Die, die, get rid of you. <laughs> just get rid of you, why don't we? You are unnecessary. Oh, come on, you turned on a dime for that one. You pulled like a 90 to, or like a 180 on that shit. You did that last time I was playing too. Like you were facing the other direction and then suddenly pull a 180. Yeah! Got you. Got you. To have been brought this low by my own ungrateful child. I would expect such treatment from my brothers, but from you. Oh God, there's a second phase. No, 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 no. Oh God, there's a second. Oh, there's a second phase. There's a second phase. I gotta get out of the way. Okay, I need to be mindful. I need to be mindful. Get rid of that. He is gonna strike me. Dodge out of the way. Okay, be be very careful about all this. Be very careful. Be be mindful when he's about to strike. Yep, move out of the way. He, that thing's about to blow up. Let's not even try it. Actually, the doom got it for me. Without even have to work for it. Send out my runes. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Nice, let, let the Doom do the work on that one because the Doom is enough damage for it to actually be taken out all on its own. Okay, okay, okay. Yep, yeah, just take a couple hits on it. Boom, there we go, there we go. Just stay here. Oh, stay here. Do not rush it. Do not rush it. Uh, what is this? What is this? What is, what are you? I don't, I don't like whatever that is. I'm going to imagine it's probably not good. Get out of the way. Oh my God. Okay, well. Dodge out of the way. Okay, 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 okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Be mindful. Don't rush it. The, the skulls are about to blow up. Yep. Stay out of the way of the fire. That's fine. As soon as he deactivates, yep, use that as my advantage. I get a few more good free hits in. Nice, nice, nice. Get a couple hits on. Activate the doom on the skull. Gets rid of that for me. Okay, okay, yep. He, he can do his stupid little green... No, 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 no. Okay. 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 Some free hits, free hits, free hits. Nice. Nice. And he's about to do it again. Okay. He's going around in a circle. He likes to really follow you. He really likes to do that ability. He really likes to do that ability. Oh, that looks like it almost glitched and went past the cover. Ah! No, 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 no. Not the skulls. Not the skull. I'm one hit. I'm one hit. Okay. I don't even know how to activate. <laughs> activate my call just in time. Dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Be careful. Be hit that. Hit. Get. What? 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 No. What? 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 What killed me? No. What killed me? What? No! <laughs> what killed me? What are you talking about? I was so mindful about everything. What happened? What hit me? I didn't even see what hit me. Oh, come on. No. <laughs> what hit me? You gotta be. 
You gotta be kidding me. What did it? What did it? You- Oh, oh my god. Hmm. <laughs> oh my god. What even hit me? I know there was a green like base nearby, but that wasn't close enough to hit me. That was like on my bottom side. There's one to the top that was very far away. What could have been the green skull? There's one on the bottom left that was about to blow up. What I uh What do you guys got to say? Hey, you're back. Wait, wait, what happened? My list says you got killed by a redacted? What's that even mean? I've never seen anything like this. It means that my father beat me again. God oh, damn it. it. Where's no, Cerberus? Where's my dad? The there you are. I saw your father storm out of the house in his regalia. So he must have confronted you himself at last. I see that must have not gone well. You were so close. I was so close. I don't even know what killed me. Well, at least I know who will be waiting for me the next time I climb all the way to the Temple of Six and manage my way out. Don't lose heart, lad. I did not train your father, only you. He is a god, but he is just a god. If you'll forgive my bit of treason there. Just a god. Ah, uh, just a god. Just a god. Yeah, I'm sorry. He's just a god. You know, what do I know? He's just a god. You know, I, 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 know, I don't know anything better. Nyx, what do you got to say? I trust that the mirror in your bedchamber has proved satisfactory to your child. Better than I could have possibly imagined, Nyx. You mentioned there was something more that it could do once I had grown accustomed. I think I'm ready for that now. I think you are as well. Then it shall be as you wish. Thank you. Uh, you did something? Well, first of all, let's go turn in our fish here. Uh, wh what are we good for all of our fish? The catch of the day. Three different fish. We got 80 crystals and three keys. Ooh, very nice. We're sitting at four keys right now. Okay. Okay, and shades, what do you have here? If you're going to have me fix your damn spell and hold the damn letter and <laughs> fall damage. Okay, yep, fair enough. Oh, hey, you brought some fish. You can smell it all the way from down the hall. That's great. The head chef can take it off your hands. Should be right in the back of the lounge like always. Thanks for helping us out, Prince. Love you too, Dusa. Um, sure. What else can this mirror do now? So you said that you've improved it or something of the sort? The mirror's grown in power. Thank you, Nyx. What, what do you mean it's grown in power? Uh, I haven't really, um, haven't really seen any, it, nothing looks different. I mean, I know we can upgrade it for another 10 keys, but I'm not really seeing anything different at the moment. Uh, I know we can swap things around and stuff like that. Well, all right. Well, thank you, Digitees, for watching the video. Thank you for watching the episode. Thank you for watching the series in general. And, uh, oh God, I am pained. I am so pained. I cannot believe, I honestly don't know what killed me i am dumbfounded i am not even sure how we lost all 175 health to begin with like the very first it did like 30 damage and then like the next one did like 15 and then somehow after that i just lost everything when he summoned his minions i just lost it all for some reason and then on top of that i managed to do well there in the in the second half but again don't know what took me out it is what it is but hey, leave a comment down below if you guys like this long commentary kind of rambling style. Or maybe do you prefer the one where I just don't do any commentary? You just like to see me play. Would you like to see a win? You know, I bet, I guarantee you, okay? I, I bet that if I were to do a no commentary and actually just play and focus and concentrate as much as I can instead of about anything that I'm saying, I probably could win this. But the thing is, this is a roguelike, right? You're supposed to build yourself up. You're supposed to get stronger. You're supposed to get more capability. You're supposed to get, you know, more abilities in general. So, you know, at this rate, we might just be end up reaching, you know, the very end on Saturday, you know, at the very end of the week, you know, we might be, uh, we might be reaching the end there, but I'm not going to end this series until at least the last episode is that I beat my father and meet my mother and see what it is on the outside. So thank you, Digities. Subscribe if you want to see those episodes, leave a like and all that fun crap. You already know what to do. I just don't really know how to do any of these outros, but there's one thing I can always guarantee you. So I'll be able to see you guys in the next video. Thank you and bye-bye.